The other stock that we're looking at is Lindy India. Once again, a good set of numbers coming through. Sonal, take us through some of the highlights here. Oh yes, it was a good set. Uh, there was a sequential decline, but on a YY basis, the numbers look decent. There was a revenue growth of 18%, EBITDA grew 41%, and margins there higher by 500 basis points, indicating some recovery. So uh, that bodes well for the stock. Profits also up 50%. Now, in terms of their segmental breakup, it was the gas and related products that led to this beat, and of course, it's the bigger segment for the company as well. That's where the revenues went up by 22.5% on a YY basis. The project engineering revenues they were up 33% to come net 189 crore rupees in terms of ebit as well it was a strong showing from the gas and related products where it was up 34% at 122 crore rupees uh, the ebit was flat for project engineering segment uh, in terms of their balance sheet as well they've been able to increase the cash and cash equivalent so uh, higher liquidity is something that the street likes as well uh, their cash stands at 1200 crore rupees versus 980 crore rupees uh, that is as in 31st march Additionally, the company has also announced a dividend of 12 rupees per share, which includes a special dividend of 7.5 rupees per share. Uh, so ticking all the right box, uh, the stock is hard in trade today. Thank you very much uh, for that. And uh, even uh, the year-on-year -year numbers have seen a phenomenal improvement.